Hey there, Abhi Devananda here, and welcome back to our musical tour of Prabhatsangeet. As we travel through Baba's songs, wending our way to the Supreme, let me be your guide. Understanding songs is both a bit easier and a bit more complex than understanding ordinary poetry. Poetry tends to be linear, whereas song is largely circular. There is generally a refrain, and that refrain may take on additional layers of meaning each time it is repeated. And then there's the music. A melody might not speak in words, but it certainly can convey emotion. And those emotions tend to clarify meaning. Undoubtedly, good translation must be technically accurate. But that's not enough. It must also capture the underlying meaning and the spirit with which it is expressed. Can Prabhat Sangeet ever be fully captured in another language? I don't know. I doubt it. But leaving that question open, let's consider Song 362. On a new dawn with crimson effulgence, frequently my heart yearns for him. With sweet love and soul's lyrics, it goes on singing his melody. The red-flushed eastern heavens, the pleasant, gently flowing breeze, all sweetness comes filled with nectar. This morn I remember one beyond form. I have nothing left to lose. Constantly my brimming heart exudes at his impulse in his music, to his infinitude, it races enraptured. Rupati 
Thank you. 